I'm sure all of you guys know BLC Media Player, right? The popular open source video playing application that is go to for all the people for playing videos. What if I say that it's banned in India? Yes, it is banned in India. So let's find out on why BLC Media Player is banned in India. So what happened to VLC Media Player? When was it banned? And first of all, why was it banned? All these questions popped up when I also heard this news for the first time. Well, don't worry, I'm here to explain on what happened on VLC Media Player and why was it banned in the first place. But before that, if you don't know who I am, well, I'm your host Arnav and you are watching Tech Arena. And by the way, like this video because it can help reach more and more people. And also consider subscribing to our channel because there are a lot of tech videos which we upload on a daily basis. And also share this video with your friends and also press the bell icon to get all the notifications whenever I post any new video. So let's get back to the topic on why VLC Media Player was banned. First of all, let me explain what is VLC Media Player ban itself because most of you might think that, hey, VLC Media Player still works on my PC and phone. Then why are you saying that it's banned? Now, when I say VLC Media Player is banned, it doesn't mean that the app itself is actually banned. It means that the website from where the app should be downloaded is actually banned. Now, if you go to videoland.org, the website won't simply load if you are here in India. So if you already have that app in your phone or your PC, you are safe to use it. Nothing will happen. It's not that you shouldn't use just because it's banned. Now let's talk about the reason why VLC Media Player's website is actually banned. And we actually don't know what happened and what is the actual reason behind the ban of VLC Media Player. But from my research, I think I've landed into a conclusion on why it was banned, maybe. Well, according to Videoland's official Twitter page, VLC was banned way back in February 13, 2022. And since then, they didn't know the reason why the website was blocked access from the Indian soil. After that, on June 8, with the help of IFF, which is Internet Freedom Foundation, VLC Media Player filed an RTA to the government asking the reason behind the ban of their website. And then, from the Ministry of Information and Technology, they got a simple answer saying, no information available which means that the government wasn't aware of the ban of VLC Media Player's website. Then what actually happened? So after I dug deep in the internet, I found many things regarding the ban of VLC Media Player. According to India Today and Times of India, there's a Chinese hacking group called as Cicada, which is backed by Chinese government. And they have started using VLC Media Players to launch massive malware attacks. And this information was somehow known to the ISPs and telecom operators here in India, who actually decided to manually block the access of VLC Media Player. It is not the government, but it was actually the decision of some major ISPs and telecom operators to ban the access towards that website. While the ban is not for everyone, it is only for certain people who use popular telecom operators network or popular ISPs network. So say for example, I did a small test on the VLC's website. So I directly went to VLC's website and it showed me this. But now when I connected to an Indian server through a VPN, the website actually loaded. So if that website is actually banned, then it shouldn't work in the first place if I use an Indian VPN, right? I did the same for TikTok's website, then it didn't work. It didn't work on my network. It didn't work after I used a VPN an Indian VPN, which clearly proves us that this is not a country ban, but instead this is a ban by popular ISPs and popular mobile networks. And not only that, I also discovered an article on India Today, which dated back in 2021, which talked about ISPs and telecom operators banning different websites. And the way they do is by using different methods. And after they ban a website, they don't give any information to its users. And not only that, they ban these websites when the government instructs them to do. So from the information that I researched myself and also is available on the internet, I came to a conclusion that VLC Media Player website is banned because of the Chinese hacking group called as Cicada, who uses that particular video player to launch massive malware attacks. Now, what do you guys think about this ban on VLC Media Player? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And I know I'm pretty late to the party because the website was banned way back in February 2022. And at that time, many people didn't know. But right now, this particular information is trending all around in the internet. And that's why I also decided to make a video since it's been more than six months of this incident being happened. Anyways, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And as always, share this video with your friends, like this video if you really enjoyed and subscribe to Tech Arena for more interesting and amazing tech content. This is me, Anav, signing off. Talk to you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.